Hi, in this tutorial I am showing how to copy the Fedora instance to one system to another system or while you are getting your system getting any virus then you have to before you can back up the Fedora instance and then after the format you can restore your Fedora instance for previous one where when you have backup so in this tutorial I show you the detailed steps about the Fedana backup or restore of Fedana while you are backupping the Fedana instance first we need yes here the Fedana instance and backup Fedana instance clone uses of this when you system got virus when you format your system if you want to copy Fedana instance from one system to another system this tutorial will help you for this the first you have to back up the database and the other one you have to copy the Fedora folder to another safety place or if you want to planning to format the C drive then you can to copy the Fedora instance to D or E or some pen drives or some external hard drives here my instance is in C drive the C and uh, this is the Fedana instance which I am using then I am copying copy this and I am copying this to D drive as it is it says is 65.2 MB it is copying is the Fedana instance is copied and open this Fedana and go to configuration file then open the database dot yml file as I am opening this file here you can see the Fedana database name Fedana underscore ultimate is my Fedana database name then you have to back up this Fedana ultimate database ok then close this then you can also minimize this one and then I have installed you have to download the MySQL administration tool which is available in the MySQL website product download then you will get the uh, you can see the download you can so see the download link in the tutorial description then you can download the MySQL administration tool from there then now I am installing the administration tool here I download it through internet download manager it is the down it is the download file I am installing it open next and then I already install this one then you can modify next no need to do anything here you can go through next next only then it will install and you can after that you can click on finish then go to start menu all programs then scroll down then here you will see a folder mysql click on the mysql then you will get the mysql administrator icon ok click on that MySQL administrator then you will get the pop-up menu in this pop-up menu the store root connection one the second one is server host localhost port is root root no need to change this anyone then username is root the password is as per your root password here my password is root then hit ok then you will get the Fedana administrator sorry uh, mysql administrator administration window here there are so many options are there our option is for the database backup you can go to backup then here 
your all databases which are installed in MySQL will shown here. Yes, our target is only back up the Fedana Ultimate. This uh, this Fedana Ultimate database only. Click on Fedana Ultimate database, which is the backup, which is the required database, and then click on the this up arrow. Then it will pop up the all the tables which is in the Fedana database. Then execute button will be highlighted here. Then execute backup now then another window will open this will uh, the script name you have to give here just I am giving the Fedana underscore ultimate yes Fedana underscore ultimate Fedana underscore ultimate okay I am also uh, saving this file at which I have copied as my computer on D drive and this is a Fedana as the Fedana which is I have copied this yes Fedana folder yes open the save then it is uh, exporting all of the data, uh, data tables into your Fedana backup folder as which is D in Fedana Fedana ultimate has been created okay okay although you can see you can see the backup folder then you can close this window or the file close thus you can see the backup file is the, the D drive and which is Fedena and then here I have saved the Fedena SQL ultimate the, this is this file I have created now time is 9 file this is the previous one which is I have backup earlier this is the backup file which we have backup now today date is 5 12 2013 9 5 pm i have created this tutorial okay here is the fedana ultimate backup i renaming this to new okay uh, just i'm close this window this is the steps involved in the backup just the another process is this is my Fedana instance my uh, username is admin and the password is I have already saved the login yeah this is the Fedana say uh, you are so crazy because uh, the Fedana instance I have changed some of the colors and I have already already installed the library plugin also okay you can change here you can change your school management system here you can powered by the your name to your name.com this is tutorial also available you can subscribe okay this is the backup of the Fedana instance now we have to restore the what is the restoring process yes I am showing the restoring process of the Fedena just after the after you format the system your system may be clean and the no instance of Fedena the go to come my computer then C drive then this is the folder which the earlier folder uh, this is the folder I have copying here just copy this folder I assume that you can copy this folder from here then after that instead of rack db colon create you have to restore the database okay the before uh, after, before you restoring the database you have to install the mysql in mysql.exe or mysql server after that you can run all the commands which which way which value installing the Fedana instance accept rack db create okay and also rack db uh, rack Fedana install plugins also you no need to uh, you no need to do you no need to run those two commands that's just I am restoring just I am copying 
the data this is the fedana instance which i have this one i'm copying this just i am renaming data it's fed now backup just i am copying this folder to c drive after copying is finished you have to restore the database it is very important and if you go through these steps it is very easy otherwise you may face a problem with this okay copying for instance then here you have file then you can also install the my sql gui tools or administration tools then open the administrator tool my sql administrator tool then root the password is also root you must install also my sql server also then only you will get it okay uh, then you have to restore yes here here i want to restore the database then open back file restore content and open back file just close this minimize this and you have to show open back file as in the my computer c drive then go to fedana backup and you will have then open back a file if it not shows show all files then go to fedana backup then open then here you can you can see the original schema means it will restore the previous database as it is with the database name and everything okay start restore it is restoring the database is the database is restoring okay the restoring operation was completed close then you can also close this then i am checking whether the database is work the fedana instance is working fine or not go to command prompt then go to fedana let's go backup instance then ruby i'm running the script of the backup file ruby and script slash server and uh, here i am changing the port to minus hyphen p and i want to run the port number 3005 port 3003 port number yes yes it is showing that http colon slash slash localhost 3003 now i am checking whether it is working or not localhost oh see localhost colon 3003 yes it is working fine the the admin the password is i forgot the password just i will try yes it is working yes this is the fedana instance which i have restore version yes you go follow go through steps so if you want any queries if you want any if you have if you have any problems just contact us thank you